Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. I know I've been MIA for almost a month now, but it's just that I've been going through a lot of personal issues, mentally and emotionally draining, that I haven't had time to actually sit down and film for you guys. And I haven't been motivated, but I promise that I'm gonna push all that to the side and just keep it going because life keeps on going, right? And as you guys saw in the description down below, we're going to be unboxing the most coveted. Well, I don't know if it's the most coveted, but I believe that in my case, I've been wanting this bag for over a year. It's been sitting in my wish list. And I can't believe I finally managed to get my hands on this bag. And I'm going to unbox it with you guys. It was super unexpected, but... I'm so excited about it. First of all, I have to say thank you to my hubby because without him, I wouldn't have had this beautiful little bag with me. And quick little backstory, I did not think I was going to get my hands on this bag at all this year. I had given up completely. I just didn't think I was going to get this bag at all. So we went to the Beverly Center and we're walking around with our pretzel and he's like oh let's go check out Louis Vuitton and I'm like we can't like we can't go every single time we come here we can't be going into Louis Vuitton but he's like come on babe like let's just go take a look so we go in and the sales associate is telling me like oh what are you looking for and I'm like nothing we're just like kind of like just browsing I've been wanting a speedy 25 for I believe like two months but you know me I like to look at the bag up front in like personal like just stare at it put it on make sure that's really what i want make sure is that making sure if it's a good financial decision to do and he was like oh yeah totally like i'll show you the bags so he brought out three speedies um they were all 25s they were in demir bean and monogram print but i don't know i wasn't feeling them that much like i knew i wanted one but <sighs> something out of my eye i don't know what anyways but i don't know like i honestly didn't know and then he brought out a speedy 30 in the game on collection but it kind of wasn't for me i don't know i didn't like it and then i saw him pull out a small little dust bag and i was like is he gonna show me like another little piece from the game on collection i don't know that's what i was thinking but when he pulled it out from the handles and i saw the monogram print and i saw that it was the speedy nano oh my god I was I was gone like I was gone completely gone and he's like I knew you were gonna go crazy for this bag he's like you're lucky I'm showing you the bag right now um he's supposedly him well yeah him he said that um they only received a few for the holidays and they sold out quick and that the one that I was looking at was one of the few he said I don't know there's like two or three left if I'm not mistaking but he said that there were only a few here and that i would be very lucky if i would take it and i was looking at him like stop talking stop talking you don't have to sell it for me i'm gonna take it and i looked at my husband and he's like oh, okay diana like it's for you you've been going through a lot you deserve a little bag and i'm so happy that i added it to my collection and yeah so let's get into the unboxing um, oh, and by the way, he said that there's only 15 left in the United States, so they're pretty hot right now. So if you've been looking into getting one, please go check your local Louis Vuitton boutiques. I'm pretty sure they're going to have at least one available. So run, call them, reserve it, do what you have to do. Let's go unbox this bag. I think it's super cute that he actually boxed the speedy nano in such a big box but it's okay i don't mind it let's open this up and by the looks of it it's a very tight knot i don't think i'm gonna be able to get it off but it's okay i can just scoot it over i think i can okay there we go He knows how to rock boxes very well. <laughs> okay, so 
Okay, let's open her up. Ah, she's so tiny. Okay. Let me move this box out of the way. That way we could get her all the attention it deserves. So, he put tape here. I guess that way it won't roll out. She's so adorable. Look at her. Isn't she so cute? Of course, I'm going to be super, super, super good with my Vachetta. I can't wait. Oh, look, the little hardware pieces are kind of set differently. But it's okay. I don't mind it. And then let's take a look all the way around to the other side. The little Louis Vuitton hardware so cute you can see the LV here so adorable let's look at the side the stitching looks good oh, she's so cute I can't believe I finally have her in my collection so cute make sure we inspect everything the Vachetta is so brand new nano speedy in monogram yay okay let's take the strap out so the strap for the speedy nano is not um we can't take it off but i don't mind and i'm i'm i promise you i'm gonna be very good with her she's so cute let's take a look inside so she was made in paris France. yay little hardware buttons and then the rest is just like the same brown color inside from all the monogram bags her little coated fabric description and that's it this one doesn't come with a little zipper or nothing it's just a little tiny bag for you to put your phone in and your card holder and your keys and you're ready to go I love her oh she's so fresh and it smells amazing if you guys could smell this if you own Louis Vuitton you know the smell the smell of a brand new bag is always the best she's so cute she is so beautiful i didn't think i was ever going to add a speedy nano to my collection and i did i already put one of my little bandeaus on her it's not the perfect wrapping i was in a rush but i'll fix it later but she's so adorable i'm so happy my hubby got me this bag it's amazing it's gorgeous and honestly, I had seen them go on the Pretty Love website for almost two thousand, a thousand five hundred, a thousand eight hundred. Like, they are selling these babies for way more than what they're worth. Um, retail price, fresh out of the store, is a thousand one hundred and eighty, I believe, if I'm correct. But I'm so glad I waited and I didn't rush and I didn't going went the pre lifts away because now I can say I got her fresh out of the store and she's only had me and I'm so happy and grateful for this little tiny bag oh my goodness she's so cute and like I said if you guys want one you guys should definitely go to your Louis Vuitton stores that way you guys could see if they have it available she's so cute Okay, so just for size comparison, I'm going to show you guys the difference, like the size difference. If you own a cosmetic pouch from Louis Vuitton, this is the MM size, not the GM, the MM. And let's compare it with the Speedy, the, the Nano. <laughs> They're the same size. It's only that, the only difference is that obviously you have a little bit more room on the top with the Nano. And you have a little bit more room with the nano. I'm not gonna lie, you do, you do, you do. 
way more you can fit way more but it's lengthwise it's practically the same length as no it's the same length as a nano and she's so cute but she's tiny i like it i don't care she's mine i don't care whatever okay yes it's a tiny bag now for wallets i think we're gonna have to go emily it's just it's not gonna happen it's just not gonna happen with the emily but i think we could pull it off with the victorine one i'm pretty sure we can if not card holders this is why card holders were invented just for these tiny little bags oh she fits it's so cute okay so my victorine wallet fits in here and there's still a lot of room in here wow i don't know if you guys could see no you can't really see okay and let's add my phone i do have the se i think it's called the iphone the smallest iphone which that's why i'm so happy i have two phones because this one is just perfect for my small bags and i still have room in here let's throw a little fragrance in there um what else what can we put in here i mean there's still a lot of room in here a lot of room but you could even fit you could even fit your key holder and a card holder in here and you still have room so it's actually pretty roomy <laughs> can you guys see that? okay so yeah just to give you guys like a quick size reference because i know it is a tiny bag but it's pretty roomy actually you'll be amazed of how much and i'm still missing my lip gloss in here you could fit a lot i'm actually amazed she's perfect size doesn't matter it's how you manage it i mean you have to be you really have to love small bags in order to love this one but if you don't like small bags just move on go go get something else just go yeah babe i'm so 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 lucky that i managed to find this bag available because girl it's so hard to actually manage to get your hands on it and once they offer you this bag and once you find it in the boutique you better take it because by the second time you're coming in it's not going to be there it's going to be gone and it's going to be very sad <laughs> but i'm so happy i have it in my collection thank you so much for watching give have some patience have some patience with me i'm sorry i know life goes on i need to keep on going forth and i'm gonna be posting more frequently now i do miss you guys very much and comment down below do you guys like this bag has it been in your wish list or is it a hard pass for you please stay safe stay tuned but most of all stay beautiful